If this is your first time in the channel, make sure you tap that like, subscribe, and hit the bell. And for all my returning viewers, y'all already know how we get down. Let's do the roll call. Lockbox Nation, we are live and on your station. And shout out to the subs who always show love. Let's lock in. All right, before we get started today, make sure you drop a one in the comments. If you can see me clearly, got some camera switch ups going on and I just need to know. Drop a one if you can see me clearly. Other than that, let's hop straight into the news. We got a lot to talk about today. Some of this is going to be informational and a lot more of it is going to be edutainment. Yeah, yeah, it's entertainment mixed with education. It's a lot of stuff going on in the league right now, and I'm pretty sure you might have missed it. We also got to talk about Kai Sinet's highlight tape, and if you didn't see that, you might want to start on the floor because you'll be laughing so hard, you'll end up there. So I'm just trying to save you a step. He was wild. And then next we got what's going on in the West. Everybody is getting their tail spanked. The Nuggets got spanked, New Orleans got spanked, and I got a whole little segment on them because all over some free throws. You know Zion ain't the best free throw shooter, and the Dallas Mavericks know we took advantage of it. And then what else we got? <sighs> there has been a lot of rumors and speculations saying that Kyrie and Luka, Luka cannot work, but... They have to smell the coffee. The fresh baked bread is cooking. Uh-huh. You can smell it. Uh-huh. All the lies. They get to talking to Dallas Mavericks. Ain't this, ain't that. I'm over here. Push it. Yeah, yeah, I'm bringing it. Push it. I'm bringing it back. Uh-huh. Let's get into it. Okay, so we got it up. We got Kai Sinet showing his highlight tape. Now, when I first saw this, I didn't know what to expect. And yes, you see the title. You're thinking maybe like, you know, 16, 17. Yeah, you're in for a surprise. Start off with a laugh. Casanet had the highlight tape. That boy mixed them up in the highlight tape. He said he wanted to be the league MVP. The the celebrity all-star game MVP in here. Yeah. Got the B-roll, slow motion footage. Got the kicks. Dread swinging. <laughs> Ocho said he was ready. Hey, center surface too. I need to see. I need to see the ball go in, Kai. Kai think he's slick. He up here showing us the puffery. Yeah, this a highlight tape, not a tape. We want the whole tape. Let's step back in. Let me let me take that back for y'all. Let me take that back for y'all. Bruh, hey, I'm wildin'. Did y'all see that crossover on, on the youngin? Kyle with the crossover on the young, the behind the back. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. I need to see the ball going in, Kyle. I don't see the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Shannon Sharp called Kassad at three feet. And then said when he sit down, it's even shorter. So just imagine how tall these kids are. Oh, 
Now what I want y'all to pay attention to is Ocho. No, 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 no. <laughs> Ocho is cracking up, man. I can't believe. <laughs> you know something funny. When your laugh go from here all the way to your shoulders. You just. <laughs> it's not unusual. Be over there laughing, boy. <laughs> Ocho about to fall out his gut chair, man. That's tough. That's tough. So, Kassanit, man, you got to take that L on that one. Next topic. What happened in New Orleans? They got beat last night by the Miami Heat. Which for Dallas Mavs fans? Yes, 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 yes. Let's go to full screen. Yeah, for those of you who didn't know, the Pelicans took an L. Yes, we need the Pelicans to take an L because it is time for us to slide up in the standings. And boy, I am telling you, we are in the line at Six Flags with a skip pass. We're not waiting on nobody. We're ready to go to the top. If you're not ready, you're not handling your nightly commitment. The Dallas Mavericks are coming. We are coming. Yes, I say we are coming. We're not worried about the Nuggets. We're not worried about the Timberwolves. We're not worried about the Clippers. They just took an L, so we're not worried about the Clippers either. We already beat New Orleans. We number six. All these teams, like I said in the other video, they have to play each other, and we need them to take L's. Lots of L's. Because the only thing we're going to be taking is dubs. Yep. We're going to be taking straight dubs out here. Long claps. Long claps for the people in the back. For the people at home. Dallas and the non-Dallas fans. The Mavericks are here. Lukai are here. But let's get into it. Because if you don't know, there was a scuffle. A straight scuffle. Let's hop into it. Apparently, a whole bunch of players got ejected on this situation. Okay, so as you can see, ooh, Jimmy had it. Hey, Jimmy, I'm not going to lie, bro. You can't be getting ripped by Zion. Bro, that's tough. Let's see that again. Or was it a foul? Kevin Love with the foul. Yeah, we're going to foul you. We're not going to give you that two points. We only up by four. Come on now. Okay. So we see Zion gets up in a very frantic state. Zion gets up in a very frantic state. Oh, that's good. So you got... So... The New Orleans player went in and tried to grab Kevin Love, but Jimmy said, get your hands off my partner. We don't roll like that. Touch your own man. Help him up. So Jimmy was all like, my mama didn't raise no fro. Jimmy like, I smoke, smoke. Somebody say smoke. What you want? What you want? What they really want from it? Somebody needs to have a conversation with Valentunas. Grab your own player. Let me read. Grab your own damn player. Where's Draymond Green at? Yeah, yeah. I'm not an advocate of violence, but it's supposed to be a headlock or a chokehold going on somewhere. Don't grab my teammate. This is why you have lessons learned. Draymond had a lesson learned. 
Rudy Gobert had a lesson learned. Valanchunas is out here. Now, if somebody puts him in that situation, are we going to have the same smoke? Because he should have been grabbing his own player. But yet, he's grabbing somebody else. Let's make it make sense. He don't really want to throw hands. Jordan Hawkins holding him back. Then be like, I'm straight. I'm straight. I'm cool. I'm cool. You got me? All right. Watch my left. Look at Bam. Talking under your breath. Marshall. Yep. See, look, I told you. He better learn. Grab his own player. Somebody's like, nah, don't be grabbing my. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there you go. He say, don't touch my player, bro. Who is you? Who is you? Touch your own man. Look at look at Ducky Robinson like, oh my gosh. Like I'm I'm right in the middle of this. I just wanted to shoot. Hey man, chill, chill, guys, chill. Why are y'all touching me? I'm trying to help out. That, I can't even say that was the foul. Yeah, that was a foul. Oh, push him. Ooh. Number eight, bro. Chill out, bro. You trying to choke people? Oh, they got them long, dirty nails. All right, so this is a better angle, y'all. Okay. Okay, so look, so up in the top, right by uh, the scores table, that's the dude who pushed Valentunas. Let's see what happened. Oh, was what was that? My bad, y'all. I gotta take that back. Y'all got look at look by the scores table. Oh, okay, over there, Alvarado. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, man, that's enough of that, man. If y'all want to see any more of this, y'all going to have to look it up on yourself. This is where it's at. Y'all going to have to look it up for yourself, man. This is where it's at on ESPN. All right, last but not least, we got to get into these highlights. All right, man, so y'all know we got to get into these Luka highlights or these Kalu. I kind of like Kalu's. Kalu sound a little better. Yeah, Kylu. So we're gonna say Kylu Lukai. Yeah, they twins around here. One A one A. We got two superheroes. Yeah. Crime fighting duos up in this thing. Lukai and Kylu. Uh-huh. Let's get into these highlights, y'all. All right, so we got Lu. <laughs> I'll say Luca. Alright, so we got Luca backing down in the post. And cause Devin Booker has to shade over. You know what that is. That's cash, baby. That's cash. Kyrie with the shot. Okay. Oh, D Live. See, we got the defensive presence. We got Kyrie floating. When you have somebody down in the paint who could challenge shots, then the players who are out on the perimeter, they can gamble more. They can be more active, hopping in past lanes, and not being worried about getting beat or being in a position to where it looks like they're getting beat on the back end. So Derek Lively and Gaffer, even Maxi Cleaver does a great job of putting the people that's in front of him on the perimeter in a good position to where they're not being looked at as a liability on defense just because they made a gamble and their man passes them because they have somebody that they're funneling the ball handler to to be able to contest the shot. can make the shot more difficult. Yeah, they can definitely do that. They can make the shot more difficult so they're able to be aggressive on the perimeter and then be able to funnel people into the help down low. Okay, so we get it. We out and running transition. We got Josh Green coming up. 
And see right here, we got three sons player, two in backpedaling. So you're already beat. You got one person actually facing, not even looking at his man. Lukai. Oh, oh, what you gonna do? He never even had a chance. He stayed in his backpedal the whole time. And it's just amazing the the way Kyrie can maneuver the basketball when he's attacking the rim. Check this out. You just got to run that back, man. Hold on. Ooh. So he, ooh. And he switched the hands and put some spin on it. Luca. Gaff did something. Look at that defense. PJ Jail. That's what they calling it. PJ. PJ. Uh, it's P, P Lockdown time. Lights out. PJ's on the scene. The, Kyrie to four. Power four. Ky Ooh. Kyrie dropped the bomb on him. Kyrie dropped the bomb. Kyrie dropped the bomb on him. What you got? What you got? We back. We back. We got everybody shooting back in transition. Okay, DJJ. A lot of people won't admit this. PJ Washington is a great defender. PJ Washington was also getting killed in the first quarter. What happened? They put DJJ in. So anybody who's sleeping on DJJ thinking that he's not him either, you're slipping. Because when KD was going off, first thing he did, put DJJ on him. He put him in the game. He was able to get him off a rhythm. Okay, so now we got Maxi Kleber in at the five, and that gives us spacing. Therefore, everything's open. It's a lot of room for Kyrie and Luca to work. Luca, Kai Lu to work out here. Oh, that boy ankles hurting off that. Yeah, just big body. Yep, that's that Larry Bird pass behind the fake pass behind the back on him. Fake pass behind the back. We got to see that again. I boom got him in the air. Oh, yeah, look at that pass fake right behind him. That boy literally gonna turn. You see, he look, he looking for the ball. He looking for the ball. Luca dropped the bomb on him. Drop the bombs in the comments. Luca dropped the bomb on him. Oh, Josh Green with it. The Suns look like they back. One, two, three. Oh, Booker, why are you so deep in the paint? Who are you going to contest? Mm-hmm. Okay. So you already know the Suns are already in a bad position. They basically got two on one, two on Luka. That's an average shot for Kai. What, he going to slide up? We still got two people in the corner. One of them leave. One goes to the corner. So we got Kyrie Irving open here for an open three. That's definitely makeable for somebody of his caliber. We got Maxi Kleber Roman ready to make a back cut. We got PJ over here in this corner. KD's not even looking at him. Then we got Josh Green over here. And then we got two players right here not even looking at nobody in this corner. Luca bates it, takes it to the hole. That's light work, man. Luca is a tank, man. He gets downhill in that paint, and he is dropping the bomb on you. Uh-oh. Mason Allen out here on the island getting lost in the sauce. 
about to go up against the sauce boss, madman, Kyrie Irving, handling master, the caster, the one and only in motion, get the coasting, slide you this way, slide you that way. I'm off the top, off the dribble, and on your dome with this bucket. Get your hand off me, Grayson. Get your hand off me. That's a foul. One, two, one, two, and it is cash, cash. Drop the cash sign, money sign, make it rain. So I tell you, Dallas Maverick fan, this is the best time to be a Dallas Maverick fan. So many people will sleep on us. Like I say in the last video, we not woke. We been up. And now you up. It's a lot going on in the West. And the number one thing is the Dallas Mavericks on a seven-game win streak beating teams. Not winning against teams. We are beating teams. We are getting in the paint. We're physically beating these teams. Skillfully beating these teams. These teams cannot hold us. Dallas Mavericks this year, this season, this part of the season, we're locked in. And we're focused. That being said, thank y'all for tapping into the channel. Lockbox Nation, signing off your station.